What's up guys, welcome back to Frosty Gaming. Uh, first off, thank you guys for so much support on the uh, new setup video that I've done. You guys have been showing uh, DJ JDB on YouTube, uh, DJ JDB 23. You guys have been showing him quite a bit of love over on his channel. I definitely appreciate that. I, I uh, incorporate his songs here and there just to uh, kind of give him a little bit of a shout out, get his uh, get the ball rolling for him. Um, just kind of get his, his music out there, get his word out there. So thank you guys so much for that. Also, um, the, the, what's happening on the channel now, I'm, I'm kind of contemplating um, getting rid of these three monitors right here. You guys saw me do a review on them not too long ago. I've had them for a little over a year now. I haven't had any problems with them or anything like that. I think I got like one dead pixel in one of the monitors, which you don't even notice one dead pixel anyway, anyways, because the pixels are so small. But anyways, I'm thinking about upgrading monitors. Now, I have a couple of choices. Um, I'm trying to talk to LG and see if they'll send me one or two uh, 34 inch ultra wide curved monitors or their, their new LG ultra wides or, and those would obviously be 1440p. So um, we'll be upgrading from 1080p to 1440p. So let me know what you guys think of that. And um, I've also been looking at ROG Swifts. So you can uh, switch from 144, 120, or 60, I believe it is. Um, I'm not quite sure on that, but uh, I don't. The bezels aren't thin enough on those for me. Um, I've also been looking at uh, some Dell monitors that are they're very hard to find, but there's some Dell monitors out there, and also a Vizio TV that has really thin bezels on it. It's just a metal border, just like my monitors have right now, and it's just, the screen pretty much goes all the way to the edge. Um, those are 40 inch. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, 40 inches, so three 40 inch screens. That would be awesome. That's like the size of a little bit smaller than my TV up here. So can, if you guys can imagine three of those. If you guys know who Barnacle's Nerdgasm is, um, I actually talked to him on Twitter here and there, and um, he has three 46 inch or 47 inch uh, TV monitors as as his setup so his uh ifinity setup or his surround setup now he has i think he i think he recently upgraded i don't think he has um i think they're 60 inch now 360 inches but i don't and i think they're all 4k but i don't think he uh has updated a video on that yet if he has i'll have to go check it out but anyways guys um so yeah so i'm looking at upgrading the monitors um i don't think i'll have enough room in this room for uh three 34 inch ultra wide so i might have to do two down below and one on top or if i go rog rog swifts or that'll be fine I'll, i can go rg swift or um also acer predator I think it's Acer. Acer Predator. They put out a monitor that's 34 inches and it's 200 hertz refresh rate. Can you imagine that? That'd be crazy. You, you, the human eye can't really see any anything much past like 120 or something like that anyway, or 144, whatever it is. I always thought it was 60 for the longest time, but. Um, Guys, if you have any feedback, let me know in the comments down below. I'm going to try to get my hands on some of these things and uh, review them for you guys. Uh, in the meantime, um, Everyday Tech is coming up every single Tuesday at uh, 2 a.m. my time. So it's, uh, it's going to be mostly during the morning and daytime for the rest of the world. So the rest of you guys can see it. Um, if you guys want to know anything on Everyday Tech, always leave it in the comments down below on my videos, guys. Let me, let me, let me see what you guys want to see. Um, as far as, just leave a comment, say, uh, in Everyday Tech, I wanna see a video of your graphics card, or my graphics cards, or my CPU cooler, or whatever it is, or my TV. I've already done the monitors, uh, two headsets, the Xbox One Elite controller, my phone on my case phone, or the case on my phone, actually. Um, if you guys wanna see anything special, well, always let me know in the comments down below, guys. I read all your comments, even though I may not message back to you guys, every single one of your comments has been read i guarantee it so if there's actually like a serious question or anything like that um i'll answer it on my vlogs or anything like that we're also going to be doing a uh, ask me uh, type of video in the future here because we've gotten quite a bit larger so if you guys have any questions to ask me i'll be doing a special video for that where you guys can leave your questions in the comments so not on this video but on that video in the future uh possibly next weekend we'll see on that okay so maybe it'll be like a valentine's day ask me type thing maybe we'll see 
Um, so anyways guys, what do you think of the Everyday Tech series so far? Uh, I think it's taken off pretty good. We've had some pretty good likes and uh, not so many dislikes, whatever. So it tells me that you guys like it and there's been a decent amount of views on it. So um, anyways guys, I think that's going to do it for this video. Let me know in the comments below on this video what you guys want to see on Everyday Tech next Tuesday. I'll also do a poll on Twitter of what I see are the top three on this video in the comments and then I'll do a poll. If there's not enough, I'll do a poll on Twitter. So if you guys aren't following me on Twitter, scroll down in the description and follow me on Twitter. So that's pretty much going to end the video. Also in the comments, make sure you guys put what you think would be the best monitor upgrades. I'm going to have to probably get into a bigger place because as you guys know, this is all in my bedroom. Um, I'm probably going to have to get upgrade to a bigger place so I can have my office in one room and do like a huge display. I'm going to go with a custom built desk. I'm just going to go all out on it. And no, I don't spend money just because you guys are YouTube. Yes, I like people seeing it. But, and no, I don't spend the money just because I want to be famous. I actually enjoy tech. It's my passion. I love building it. And it's just awesome to see people's reactions. But anyways, guys, we'll see you in the next video. Stay frosty.